Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of The Long Dark. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that it's just to join me today here in the Grey Mother's house. As uh, we just slept, and uh, we're gonna drink a little bit of water, sleep our other hour of snoozing. That's what I do myself, sleep for all however many hours I need to sleep for, minus one, and then I snooze for one, and I'm always grumpy in the morning, because probably all that, but if I don't do that, I get, get even more grumpy. Anyway, so it's daytime, oh, it's not daytime yet, Oh, I don't need to sleep, do I? Maybe I do. I did eat, last episode, I did eat a bunch of things, so, yeah, we're good. We're also making our own rabbit skin mitts, or mittens, or whatever that's called, or gloves, or something. Man, this night doesn't want to go away. Ah, oh, well. Let's go down here and have a chat with the Grey Mother, because she had something to tell us. Hey. I can't be here anymore. My friend is out there and she needs my help. Please, tell me how to find her and I'll do whatever I can to help you get out of here. There's only one thing left to be done. You need to put her to rest. Put her to... I'm not giving up yet. On the other side of town, there's a farmhouse. You'll find a key to a safety deposit box somewhere in there. Go to the bank and bring me the box that matches the key. Then you'll understand what happened to her. Wait, farm? Bank? What's this have to do with my friend? She didn't say your they friend. They left her, didn't they? She needed help, and they let her go. What? This is how we make it right. I don't understand. In the bank, you'll find the answers. Now go. Yes, I will. I will. You seem distracted, tired. Are you okay? I'm old. Sometimes the mind wanders, outsider. Travels to other places, other times. I... Think about her, cold and alone. She's talking about somebody else, I think. It, it sounds like it, doesn't it? Are you talking about my friend? They should have helped her, again, so she's like, she doesn't listen to me. And I think that explains why her dialogue is so crazy. Um, because she's not directly answering to me, and that's why it sounds a little bit weird. She was there at the bus, I'm sure of it. You have a sense of her passing there? I think she left a sign for me, a word, perseverance. A world from the old days. Why would she write that? A world from the old, old days? Or do you mean a word from the old days? Why would she write that, she asks. I don't know. Maybe she wanted me to know she wouldn't give up? Or reminding you not to? Yeah, it has to mean something more. Why? Because you matter so much to her? No, because she wrote it in her own blood. How do you know it was hers? Nah. There is a town far to the north. Perseverance Mills. Maybe she was showing you the way. Perseverance Mills. How, how do I get there? There is no way now. By car, perhaps. On foot? No path that Grey Mother knows. Okay. Um, you mentioned a farm? Yes, on the other side of town. The old Barker farm. Barker? Yes, a liar and a thief, mostly. Right. You'll see. Will I? Huh. I'll see what I can find. I need anything right about now. Shut up. Uh, so I need to ask about the bank. Tell me about this bank. Bah, bank from the mainland. Never belonged here. Yeah, well, usually banks are pretty secured. Uh, not, not sure I'll be able to get in. The branch closed years ago. The collapse took everything. What, what do you do about money? Some of us still use the old paper. Or barter. I haven't seen paper money in years. What of value? What value? What a value could possibly be left in the bank? You ask questions when you should be finding answers. Now get me to safe the safety deposit box. Then everything will become clear to you. Okay, sounds like like a plan. I'll see what I can find. And I'm not gonna eat a horse on the way there either. Okay, so we're good here in terms of pretty much everything. I'm gonna drop uh, this over here because I don't need that. Those things are heavy, really heavy. Yep, drop. How's my situ weight situation? Fair. It's okay. The water is weighing me down a little bit, but that's fine. Uh, we got a few rocks. That those are okay. We got a few sticks over here. Can get more on the way there, so not really too bothered with that. Let's just drop all of them. That's gonna be interesting when I have to pick those up. If I have to pick those up. 
Okay, so I'm pretty sure I'm just gonna go out right now. And that's gonna be that. I'm not gonna... It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. How's my inventory? 20 point... No decoys. No, I didn't mean to drop a decoy. If you press 3, it just automatically pre uh, drops a decoy. Okay, let's leave the house. The wolves are about. And the wind is probably also about. Well, I do wonder... Yeah, the wolf is over there. One of the wolves is over there. So let's not mess about too much with that. As we did last episode. But just to experiment, I was always going to reload. Even if I killed the wolf, I was always, always going to reload. Because I, I have no need for wolf meat. Okay, we're not really losing too much uh, temperature. Minus five. Yeah, that's perfect. Yeah, just keep it ready. I am going the right direction. Now, there is a wolf down there as well. I will try to avoid it if I can. He seemed pretty interesting in me, unfortunately. But I'll try to avoid it if I can and then just shoot it on our way back. Rather than shooting it on our way there. Because if I shoot on, on, on our way there and he decides to not run away too much, he's going to see us on our way back, so... Uh... That's not a wolf back there. I thought uh, that was a wolf over there. Okay. Oh, can't go up there. But this is protection still. This reminds me a lot of, of the Pleasant Valley map from Survivor Mode. I mean, because it's the same assets and all that. But I always I, f I always found that map to be really, really fun. It's it's Everything is far away from each other, but I think that that plays well into the game's mechanics in that particular map. Of course, this one is a little bit different. But the farm is pretty big. It's got to be a, about an acre of land over here, so it is pretty decent. For a mountain farm, yeah. You'd be able to plant a few potatoes in here, at least. Quite enough potatoes to last you a, a year. And that's just one of the crops that you can get. You have to be careful about everything. I don't know where the wolf is hiding. He might not even be here, for all I know. He might have ran away. I think I heard something. Did you guys hear something? But if... I don't know. Okay. So that's a shame. That's the best I can do. For right now. Reload. Forgot about that before, by the way. Something to eat. He was really interested in me. I wonder if he remembers that I screwed him up. Paradise Meadows Farm. Sounds lovely. Okay. We got bunnies back here. Hello, bunny. Why are you so slow? Oh, because of the... Uh, the temperature is going down. Minus 14, yeah. Ah! You piece of crap! Stop! Go die! That was not the same wolf. Holy shit. Oh, you can't go up. Yeah, there's a dead person over there. Screw that. Uh, okay. Um, okay. Okay. We're gonna be fine. Don't worry. So apply that to the wolf bite, and then apply two of these to... There we go. Whew. Okay. So everything is... Okay. Let's keep an eye on durability of things. He really went for my hands. He really didn't like my hands. Okay. Let's see what this guy has. A lockbox key. The lock... That's what the Milton farm. That's a different thing. Okay. What do we have? That'll come in handy. That did come in handy. Flare shell. Got a snare in here. I know how to set up snares. That's really cool. Can't really make those things. 
But I will need to make those things in here. So we need to come down here for for crafting. Okay. So I wonder if that's that. Our temperature is going down severely. No, there's a little far miles over there. Let's go in here. Maybe a dead battery. You think? Why do you need a bet? What? What do you mean? Maybe a dead battery. You need a dead battery? Well, oh, I have no idea what that guy's going on. This guy's gone on about, but we're okay. Yeah. So the wolf is gone. The wolf is gonna die. The one that we attacked. Door is locked. Maybe the keys are around here somewhere. That's really cool. That is really cool. Well, in the snow. It's freezing out here. It is. You just know now. Notice that. In the snow, where do you would you put a key? It need to be in a place where you knew. Work gloves over there. Some wood over here. Where you knew you wouldn't lose it. Can't feel my hands. Yeah, it's gonna be fine. I think. As long as the wolves don't come up. It's gonna be alright. We have... Yeah, we could go in through, through the window if this was a different game. Um, okay, so I'm thinking... Maybe on these things. That would make sense. Right? But apparently that's not the case. I thought I had the key already, to be honest. Oh, that pressed F. Yeah. Probably over there. But this... This has got to be the main key, then. It's not like the... It's not like the spare key or anything. Die if I don't warm up soon. I know, I know. Just get in there. We have a key like in here. Tractor. What do you mean about the tractor? I have the... Shut up about the tractor! Who cares about the tractor? Oh, wait a minute. Is that what you... Okay, I'm gonna look at the... We need to get warmed up, basically. Let's get in here. Okay, okay. Hypothermia risk, please go up. Unless, of course... He said the key was here somewhere. Okay, we're good. We're safe. Uh, I would like to repair my gloves as well, by the way. I don't want to lose them. Might want to remove them, but having no... Well, actually, I can do that. Because I have other, other gloves over here. These are frozen, though. Not great. Uh, okay, so... Set a fire in here. Uh, sadder, sadder fire, yes. Uh, can I make it with these? No, that's 0% chance. I think that's only for the outside. Can I have... Do I have... Yeah, use the ones right there. Okay, so start a fire right there. Not gonna use accelerant, even though that's gonna take a little while, but that's okay. 75% is a decent chance, and we're not really losing much. We're using a match, or losing a match and losing a uh, one of the stalks or whatever that is. Uh, if I fail, so it's fine. The chance, of course, for it to fail twice would be 75 out of 25, so this would that'd be 6.5, so we're talking about 92.5% chance to succeed at least once in two tries. That's the, the statistics. You just multiply the chance by itself. That did it. That definitely did it. Okay. So, uh, I don't think we need anything else. It's just for good heat, good warmth. So, you're going to put that away. And let's look around. Uh, so, oh yeah. I do need another thing. So, you're going to drop that. These are just wet. I don't really need too much... Yeah, these are gonna dry, it's easy. So, put them over there, and those are gonna unfreeze like crazy. Hmm, the wind is also pretty crazy. Oh, yeah, we never read the notes, did we? I guess we could read them over here. We never did read the notes, because we got a couple, we have a lot of notes in here. Uh, we got a couple of notes on our last mission. Nice, nice speaker right there. Oh, why was he a liar? He looks like a normal person. He's got a computer, pretty sweet studio as well holy crap that's awesome I wonder if it's turned if this is facing south that is this is a sweet crib right here yeah no doubt about that let's get this what do we have I can use this 
Yeah, you did use that antiseptic as well. Pretty nice. Plank. Trash can over here. What are we gonna find in it? Nothing. Oh, yeah. Uh, then, oh, sports socks. I'll take that. What, what was that green thing on the sports socks? I don't know what that was. Got a book. Nice. Just keep an eye on the fire. Although, I wouldn't mind having to... Uh, Relight it. That's okay. Yeah, this is a really cool place. Look at that. It's got a little thing over here for you to eat at, I suppose. You'd eat over here, but I don't know why you'd have this. But it's not my country. I don't know. We don't. Have, we don't usually do that sort of thing here in Portugal. We do have bars, which is sort of a, a thing, but like a you know like a b bars. Just what I mean. Whatever that is. But that would be like in a leaving room or something like that. I don't know. It's not very comfortable to sit on those on those uh, stools either way. Okay, that's already done. Got a metal pot in here. We have another can opener. Nothing in the microwave. We can close that. Metal pan. Can I please not get stuck in things? Thank you very much. What do we have up here? Not much. Neighbor's note. I wonder if that's going to be relevant. I, I do need to read all those notes, though. So, before we leave this place, we're gonna read all... Hope nobody needs this anymore. The rose hip that was in a trash can? I don't think anybody's gonna need it. Salty crackers. So, this guy... This guy had a little bit of food. In a... So, is that paint? We've got a boiler back here. Or I don't think it would be. Accelerant. Cardboard box. It's not anything up there, is there? No. Okay, so we haven't gone into the room. Uh, I'm not gonna do anything here. There's no point. In the room. Ooh. Wool mittens. That might be good. A drawer over here. It's got a, a briefcase over here. Oh, I can't open the briefcase. I thought it, would, it was gonna be the... This stuff will come in handy. Will it? A dress shirt. Really? Well, I guess it's shirt. And we have another fireplace over here. Wood matches. Good stuff. What is this? Oh! You dirty... Oh, dang you. Dang you. Ah, come on. Those things are so hard to see. They look being useful. Those things... It's it's like the the carpet, because I am I was used to being able to... Well, I expected to be able to, to destroy the carpets uh, for... Um, Destroy the carpets for cloth, and then it turns out that the uh, carpet that I was looking at, I didn't read what it was. Oh, I thought this was a rifle over here. Uh, I didn't read what it was, and it turns out it is. Let me burn some of these books over here. <laughs> How much? Yeah. It's good stuff. Um, and it turns out that was a secret hiding place. Huh. Yeah, the, before, on the other house. So we're gonna be a little bit over encumbered if I want to take all of this stuff with me. I'm gonna Which have I... to leave something behind. Yeah, we're gonna leave the books. Leave the books because I don't need them. Okay. Anything under the bed? Not that I can see. Good. We could, you know, we could rest here. It's not a bad place. It's actually a really cool place. Once you remove, start removing these things in here. It, gets, it becomes pretty nice. This one can't be removed, unfortunately. You could store it for book. You could use it for books. Got another book over here. Oh, I didn't look properly. Oh, I didn't look properly. Oh. He's a... <gasps> didn't come here. Emergency kit note. That'll come in handy. I'm just out of this stuff. My god. So much stuff. Okay, yeah. This is really good. This is really good. Stack of papers. Don't really need those. Okay. What is that? Is that a cassette? That is a cassette. Okay. A lot of books in here. So I think instead of burning them, I should probably just drop them over here because there's... I mean, I'm not going to need them. So might as well. Drop. Oh, really? What was I clicking? Why wasn't? It, why didn't he tell me right away that I? Whatever. Uh, okay, so we have a, a couple of storm lanterns. That's great. I don't think you can harvest the fuel from them. That's something that I 
remember wanting. No, you can't. That's a shame. That is a shame. But you can't. That's that's a real shame. What is this? I don't know what that is. Okay. So we have looked th through everything, apart from that teen of card of sardines and this thing over here. Oh my god, I haven't done a good job of this. The moldy peanut butter. Excellent, says my guy. Did it? Hmm. How did I miss that? Okay, so these things are still frozen. Boy. So, I think keeping these... Keep this thing... Keep the plug. Keep the, this thing lit can be a good thing. I can't remove the room from there. We have nothing. Okay. So, let's read the notes on, by the fire. Let me add a little bit of reclaimed wood. There we go. So, no time. We're severely over encumbered, but we're okay. Uh, okay, also I probably want to eat because I don't want to lose much, and I have a lot of food. I don't want to lose much, um, that's very good. Let's go with that. Uh, much condition, so let's do that. Drink that. Keep an eye on the time as well. So, that's done. Okay, it's early morning. Fantastic. Let's look at what we have. Oh, okay. So I have this. Oh, Astrid. Yeah. Uh, so, Astrid was her name. So, starting from the end. This emergency kit is distributed free of charge by the Great Bear Earthquake Memorial Society, JBEMS. Uh, our non-profit work helps guarantee full preparedness for any future emergencies on Great Bear. Our motto, we remember. What do you remember? Why, the Great Bear? Can I examine this? Interesting. Huh. Uh, and over here we have the neighbor's note. That was another thing that we found. Hey, Martin, we found Molly. Alice was so relieved. Thanks for helping us. Look, looks like uh, this time maybe a wolf went after her. They seem to be more and more since the quake and closer to town. Fewer people to keep them in check, I guess. Molly's hurt, but I think she'll make it. That's probably a cow, I suppose, maybe. Uh, watch out because the wolves might come after your dog, too. Oh, it wasn't. It was a dog. I know how you feel about wildlife and that you wouldn't shoot a, a wolf even if you had to, but I hear they don't like loud noises. Roadside flare, roadside flare might do the trick. Stay safe and come visit us when you can. It's not good to spend too much time on your own. John, I think he died. So I think this guy died. The Mil the Milton dude. Let's see what this one is. Overdue. Final warning. Dear Mr. Barker. Yeah, Marker Marker Barker Mill or Milton? I don't remember his name. Uh, your account in Mainline Power Corporation is now severely past due. Your account is in arrears to the tune of a uh, thousand two hundred and fifty six. Uh, dollars and 45 cents. Despite her attempt to contact you to remedy the situation on this third and final warning, we are regretfully we regretfully report that we are left with no choice but to interrupt service immediately. We have dispatched a solar or uh, a recovery crew. Speaking of solar, you don't need electrical power in here. You just get winds power and all this sort of stuff. I I'm pretty sure that's how people live in remote places like this, or at least they have like a generator or something for the whole town. We have dispatched a recovery crew to uh, repossess your leased solar block model BK1. Uh, BK oh, that was leased then. Yeah, there it is. That's, that's, what I, that's where I got the solar from before. I didn't read that. I just got my eyes saw that. Once your account has been brought up to date, we will be more than happy to restore your service. Please note that all meters reading are carried out by impartial drones deployed by our remote monitor monitoring station on Great Bear. If you would like to dispute... Oh, that's what that is, the Great Bear. It's not act an actual bear. It's probably the island that we're in. And the memorial is the what happened before. If you would like to dispute the reading, please contact your... Um, contact your... Uh, Local ombuds, ombudsman? Sure. Which, uh, according to our records, is located at missing data. So this is a formula. Oh, crap. Mainland Power uh, Corp is the primary service provider for of grid-based power to, uh, for the southern Great Bear region. We pride ourselves in our dedication to customer service and have been awarded the Musk Green Service Medallion for the past three years running. If you would like to make a payment or, or communicate with us about your account status, we invite you to contact us by phone, email, social media, or drone mailer according to the contact information provided below. Uh, thank you and have a nice day. Yeah, well, it was... Yeah. 
and we have the parking warning notice. Due oh, this was for the other van, I think. Due to the unfortunate uh, unfortunate accident, the Milton Inn Area Parks Board can no longer condone the use of the climbing area with the oh, that's the climbing area yeah, within the park boundaries. Additionally, recent size seismic activity has brought the safety of several some uh, or several common routes and climbing sections into question. We are reviewing safety policies and will publish findings as soon as possible. Until then, please refrain from using designated climbing areas in the park. Signed, M. Antony Deus, Milton and Area Parks Board. Yeah, and I think there was another one. The Prison Transport Manifest. This one I read already. So, location of the Great Bower. We are no longer positioned to ensure the adequate supply. All archaic locations have been landed. Okay, so that's the other one we read. Now we have this one over here. The following felons are stated for immediate transport to Black Rock Federal Penitentiary. Scheduled arrival Thursday, November, but it doesn't say the date. On I suppose it's on purpose, so we don't really... It doesn't really matter the date that this game takes place in. Uh, White, Irvine, Kang, Kelly, Harris, Mathis, Gabas, NG, apparently. Leclerc, uh, Kowalski, Baker. Hmm. And the Scubes. Total roster, 12 inmates, no medical conditions, none. They have no medical conditions. So this thing is still frozen, which is kind of a bummer, but the wind outside is going to kind of make sure we don't really do much apart from just staying in here. There's a scar there's is that a scarf or is that a, a tie? Kind of looks like a tie for a little bit. Yeah, I'm going to stay inside for right now. Uh, but we're out of time for the day, so let's see what happens in the next episode. For now, I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been The Long Dark. I really hope you've enjoyed it, and if you did, go ahead and leave a comment, like the video, if you want to see the next episode come out sooner rather than later. But above all, thank you so much for watching, and I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.